Good day, good day! How the honk are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Hey, we got a one of Wednesday today. And we're going to be talking about this little bugger. Yeah, I got this uh, a couple of weeks ago. You can follow that on a uh, unboxing Saturday. Yeah, got this on eBay, and I did look it up. I paid $9.99 for it and eight twenty dollars shipping. So uh, what we have here again is this is the Road Signatures. Get that to focus in here. Road signatures. It's a 124 scale uh, die cast model. And this is the Land Rover Freelander 1999 edition. Yes. Very, very cool die cast metal collection. Authentic edition. Uh, there's a warning here. So, not for children under six, small parts. Yes, so we're going to just take a look at this uh, round here again. Uh, road Signature, 124 scale. Yeah, quality handmade. There you go. You can't beat that. We'll go around to the other side here. Same ditty there. Let's uh, flip on over to the, uh, the underside because it's upside down. <laughs> yeah, the underside here. We'll go... Go to the underside here and just look at the uh, little ditty here. Once again, contains small detachable parts, appro appropriate for children over six years old, and uh, rights and reserves and all this, handled with special care because the high quality and special precisions made skill model. Yes. So that's pretty cool. And uh, so then, uh, oh yeah, let's uh, move around to the back. And that's when things get kind of interesting. Um, here are all the licensing and trademarks that they uh, hold. Interestingly enough, that uh, the um, road signatures is made by Yatming uh, Industrial Factory Unlimited. And um, they, their headquarters, and I did a little search, headquarters is Dongzheng in China. Yes. Oh, I, I think I scooted that around too soon. Uh, but made in China, yes. And uh, they sold, so I got this for less than $14.99. So that's pretty cool. You can try their uh, yatming.com. I have not tried that. I, I, I did some Googling on it, but uh, the Yatmin company, but I didn't, uh, I didn't do that website. So I, on the, when I opened this for the unboxing Saturday, I didn't think that I had a road signature Freelander, Land Rover Freelander. And I was correct, uh, partly. Yes and no. Uh, I do have this though, and I did a video on this, and maybe we'll tag that at the end. I don't know if I can tag that at the end. But uh, if you remember this Range Rover RV Urban 4 4 wheel drive is a road signature, and it is by uh, the manufacturer Yetming. Yes, so, um, and I don't know, I think this was. This is a little bit smaller scale. I can't remember now what scale this is, and I don't think I can peek down in there and uh, quite see. But it, it is not 124 scale. Um, that that uh, that does not uh, fit. That does not fit. This is a little bit smaller. This is uh, the Land Rover Junior, and this is the full you know get up Range Rover. So uh, V8, you know. So they. Uh, you know, I'm missing the bumper on that. I don't know if I knew that. I'm missing the bumper on that. Huh, did I notice that when I did that? Or did I just lose it here somewhere? I don't know. Man, I don't know. Huh. 
Maybe that's why I got this one so cheap. It was out, it, this is the way it came and I was missing a bumper, but that's all right. We just display it just like that and it's cool. All right, now that did have opening doors, which was totally cool. So go, go ahead and uh, hopefully we can tag that video at the end of the, uh, now, interestingly enough, uh, I was surprised and I was um, uh, looking at, now this this is the 1999 Land Rover Freelander in 124 scale. The number is 93024, 93024. And as far as I know, it came in two colors. This um, light green metallic, that's supposed to be a green, and then a uh, silver metallic. That is the only two flavors that this comes in, is, is just those two colors. Quite interesting. So now the Yatmin company that uh, is out of China is one of the largest uh has the largest collection of diecast model cars uh, for diecast that on on record. You know they're they're like one of the biggest companies that has the widest variety of diecast model cars, uh, spanning like this 124 scale to 143rd and 118th. So I'm gonna guess that this is like a 120 uh, 143rd scale because it's not 124th and it's not 118th, which I wish it was, that would be beautiful. So I thought, man oh man, don't, doesn't, can't Yatming do a 164th? And I tried to look up 164th because I, when I do my uh, hunting and, and uh, looking around, I find a lot of Yatming cars, but I never can find a Land Rover in the Yatming. So it's like, what the heck? Why couldn't they have done a 164? I've, I've got play art. I've got, um, you know, RMZ. I've got, uh, you know, a lot of different 164, but Yatming does not make a Land Rover in 164. So that was kind of a, kind of a bum. So we're not going to be opening this up. I'm sorry, guys. This is a sealed package. Maybe I can get another one. I was looking on eBay, and there are other ones um, for $9.99. Uh, maybe I can uh, get another one so then we can really take a detailed look in there. But uh, as you see, this is a uh, right hooker. So this is uh, uh, Europe edition this is not from the u.s although the range rover is and uh very very cool opening doors looks like it has an opening hood which you know um the the uh smaller one 143rd range rover doesn't do that but uh very very cool you see it has the open back to it and uh it kind of models and shows the rear rolled up there forward that's kind of cool and it has the split sunroofs in it nice uh, uh, two-tone color interior it's got that uh, I don't know slate uh, gray color with green uh, trim on the seats really cool the back deck is got um, green on it so that that's really kind of cool yeah, but just a neat little model here. And uh, there you can kind of see those seats a little bit better. Uh, nice two-tone there. But really a nice model, very heavy. Uh, oh, nice, my bumper's coming off of this. That's nice, oh, there you go, that's just great. Yeah, my bumper's coming off. Maybe that's why I got it so cheap, huh? And uh, I mentioned that, uh, boy, that looks crappy now. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I was waiting. These beefy tires on here. I like those uh, wheels and rims. Those uh, are really, really awesome. Uh, I also liked, and I've mentioned this before on the Freelander, I like the, the dimples or the, I don't know what you'd call those on the bottom, the five little dimples on, on the rocker panel. That is quite cool. 
Yeah, I always uh, like that. Oh, now I gotta, oh, cheese balls. I'm not doing so well here, guys. Now I lost the headlight thing here. Oh, man, alive. This is not good at all. Oh, yeah, it came from this uh, passenger side, the left side of the vehicle that light came from. Oh, my goodness. Well, I got to put this down. We got to call it a video. What an interesting uh, little truck, Land Rover Freelander from 1999 from Road Signatures. Great to have these pair. Uh, yeah, we're going to probably put them right on the shelf just like that. That is awesome. All right, that's it. Give me a big thumbs up and subscribe and share and uh, get, hit the notification bell. But other than that, thank you for joining me. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rubber day.